Chairman of CARICOM, Prime Minister Dr. Keith Rowley, has made an appeal to United States President Joe Biden's administration to use its influence to help lift sanctions imposed on Venezuela by his predecessor, Donald Trump. The Prime Minister made the appeal during a virtual interview with the Atlantic Council on Friday. The CARICOM chair said he would like to see an early review of the U.S.'s scorched earth policy in Venezuela, since the United States assessment confirmed that the ineffective harsh policies and unilateral sanctions are contributing immensely to widespread additional indiscriminate human suffering. It once again has the stature and the interest to bring the Venezuelan parties to a table with the support of CARICOM and other nations read the riot act to everybody and agree as they've all agreed that venezuelans must solve venezuela's problem not only in the interest of venezuela but in the interest of all of us who are codependents prime minister rowley described venezuela's relationship with the caribbean and the united states as fundamental to our comfort and prosperity he recalled the shelf drug and gas deal between tnt and venezuela and said Venezuela had agreed to do something that had not been done before, which is to export its gas. Because we haven't been in the gas business for so long, our fields are becoming to be worn, and we are having greater and greater difficulties finding new gas supplies. And everything was in place to have Trinidad and Tobago tap for the international market and for its own benefit, gas supplies and uh, close to our border with Venezuela and so on. But the sanctions on Venezuela have brought a halt to all of this. And what I would like to ask the new administration to do is to reset and give the dialogue a chance.